Hey y'all, hey, welcome to my channel. Y'all see I'm in a different place today. I'm actually, and I'm here working today. Well, it would have been 12 months in January, so a lot to share. And I don't know when I'm actually hey, gonna call hey, this, welcome to my channel. Y'all see I'm in a different place today. I'm actually in my office. Um, I'm blessed to have many <laughs> hats that I wear. And I am um, not only an accountant by trade, a mother, a wife, but I, um, uh, as I am a pastor's wife, you know, it's kind of weird to say because it's kind of always weird. No, don't call me first lady. Don't say any of that. I'm a pastor's wife and I'm here working today and I'm in my office, but I just wanted to give y'all an update. It has been since, let's see, tw it would have been 12 months in January. So we're now at about 14 months and this is where we are with my locks. I have a lot to share and I don't know when I'm actually going to call this, but y'all hold on because I got questions that I'm still trying to figure out. Thank y'all for watching. Don't forget to like so, and subscribe. Thank y'all for watching. Welcome to my channel. Hello, hello, hello. I had to put a little filter on this because it was a whole lot happening and I have something going on that I just don't understand. But y'all, it's been 14 months. Can y'all believe it? I cannot believe it's been an entire year. I I have great intentions. I really do when it comes to posting and sharing and adding. I'm going to, I'm due for another retire. That's how long it's been probably since I've done uh, a video for you guys. But I'm due for another retire. So I want to share because there have uh, been a few questions. I, I think there are a lot of questions surrounding um, not only price, but finding the right person. It is really hard out here in these streets. You just never know who to trust. Um, and like I said, as y'all know, I, I got two people. I mean, two, two, I'm ashy. two people that I trust. And I know that it may take me a couple right. days to even do this because it's kind of like, where do you go? What do you, what do my people want to know? What, what about this? Like, right? Like, it has not fully locked. That's one thing I can tell you. Number two is um, I've lost three locks, a total of three locks out of almost 400 locks. I have a ton of locks on my head, y'all. So you can't even tell if I lost a lock or not. Um, and I think the reason why I lost the locks was because um, when I initially started, the locks were really, really small. And with the weight of my hair now, with, the, with it swelling and doing what it needs to do, it cannot hold the lock. So... That's why I lost a couple, a few. So it's okay. If you lose a lock, don't panic. Um, I believe, I have never pl not panicked in the way that I haven't yet. Like it, it's been amazing, um, my response to You know, when you used to wash your hair and you get like a ball of uh, um, hair out of it after you take braids out or after you take down your hair from a style or from wearing a wig and you just like, oh my God, I just lost all this hair. What's going to happen? I have yet, I lose, you know, little pieces or little frilly pieces, but I've only lost three locks and y'all, I am so at peace with it because guess what? They, she going to put them back on. Yes. As soon as we find the spot, we lost them in. So if you lose a lock, you can reattach it to your head. Isn't that a blessing? Huh? Isn't that? <laughs> so that's another reason why I like, uh, lock. you know, if you didn't have a lock, what would you do? You got the little ball of hair. You just going to throw it in the trash. Do you not know how much hair I threw in the trash in my lifetime? Because I haven't been able to keep it. So if in fact you may have lost some. Now there are some, there are some that I'm just still kind of like, and I think I've, you've heard me say that before. Like, I don't know about this. I don't know about this. I don't know. But um, that's because they're so small and they're kind of like, I don't think they're going to hold on. And then it's kind of like, but I do have some things that I plan on talking to my lady about. Um, as you can see, I have a lot of crinklets and curly ends and that's where it's not locked yet. Y'all now I do have some great, look, that's, that's locked all the way down. Um, but there are some places that I am really concerned about because I'm like, okay, Either this hair is going to break off or it's going to lock up. And I don't know which one it's going to do. And that's my concern um, with my hair currently is that I'm not sure what's going to happen to all these little cute little curls that's on these ends. So if you are trying to decide on what to do or you're just looking, hey, it's me. 
again, a lot of times what you see is what you get. I got a filter because for whatever reason, I didn't, I didn't went through a major breakout and I don't even understand why, because my face normally does great, but here we are. So, um, I just wanted to share just a couple things that I'm kind of wondering about and wondering. My top is doing really well. Remember, I know y'all saw when I, I barely had, and I used to always have to wear my hair back because it, these little pieces were not here. Um, but I am really pleased. I cannot wait till this turns like this because if you could tell, the back is drastically different and so much longer and thicker than the top. Uh, I did a couple, I did like a updo thingy, which I need to perfect and get, get better at, but I can do a, one little style and that's about it. Listen, if y'all have any questions, hit me up. Let me know. I am, like I said, you can put it in the comments. Uh, you can, and, and I do, I think there's some things that I didn't do and I wanted to do and I really wanted to share with you guys. Um, again, I am a very logical person and a very practical person. So for me, things have to make sense. They have to add up. And also when it comes to, um, this journey, it has to be simple, simple enough for me it to do it because again, I'm not going through a whole lot. I'm not going through a whole lot. The extent of what I went through is waiting. Um, uh, the extent, the, the time it took to get this done. That's the, all that it took the time, the, the time of patience and understanding that it's going to take time, but anything else has to be simple. And I mean, be like, okay, let's do this. But even with understanding how long it could take, that was even understandable to me. Thank y'all for watching and thank y'all for y'all continued support. I, I am amazed again. Don't forget once I get to 500 subscribers, I'm doing a giveaway. I uh, am trying to keep up with all that's happening and all that I am looking forward to doing. I, again, I have a lot of, um, gifts and abilities that the Lord has blessed me with. I'm not saying that they I'm perfect or I'm great or I'm the best at them, but I feel like the Lord has given me gifts and I'm going to plan, I'm planning on using them. Um, and so there'll be some things that are going to be released and shared with you guys. I look forward to possibly motivating you and encouraging you, um, even more, um, throughout this journey, because I'm telling you, my hair has taught me things about myself that I did not know. Okay. How about that? Going through this process and going through this journey has been one that has been freeing, has been eye-opening, has been very uh, renewing and restorative for me. Thank y'all so for watching. Thank y'all for, for uh, subscribing to the channel. Thank you for following the journey. It has been an amazing one for me. I appreciate er all the feedback. I love everybody when they comment and say something. And thank you for the love and the likes and the all the things. I thank you. And thank you for subscribing. Do not forget to subscribe and turn the notification button on because I'm not as consistent as I want to be, but I pray that I'm able to get more consistent. But I wanted to encourage you, beautiful woman of God and beautiful lady of God. I want to let you know that you are beautifully, fearfully, wonderfully made. And there's nobody that can take your place. As long as you're on this earth and as long as you are living, there is nobody like you. There is nobody that has been created to do what you do. So you do what you do and you continue to become whatever God has intended for you to become. So thank you guys for watching and I love y'all and peace.